Hi everyone, my name is Kelly Reese and I'm coming to you from my backyard on a beautiful summer day in Ohio. I want to welcome you to the Hope Project. I will be one of the people that will be facilitating this group over the course of the 31 days in July. So the purpose of this video is to tell you kind of the idea behind the group and what you can expect. So you will know whether or not this is a group that's going to serve you and something you want to participate with. Um, so how this group came to be is I was doing a training about the amount of interactions that are required to overcome one negative interaction. Okay, so we need six positive things to overcome one negative thing. And this just kind of blew me out of the water. Like I knew we need more positive than negative, but the more this training went on, I realized I've really been struggling. Like I think a lot of us have been over the last several months. All four of my kids are in school, so all of them came home. Um, I am a people person. I love to be around people. I love to touch and hug and all of those interactions that have been um, really, really limited recently since everything's been happening in the world. So I've been kind of down in the dumps and I've been struggling and I knew I was struggling from more isolation than normal, but I started to think, it's more than that. I'm also probably struggling because the positive to negative interactions that are needed for optimal emotional health has got to be totally out of whack, right? If you scroll Facebook for a half an hour or if you watch a half an hour of the news, there is very little positive that you're going to find, but there is a lot of negativity out there. So the first purpose for this group was to create a group that only is going to offer that positive content to help us fill our source, right? To help us fill us up and get those interactions back into that ratio we need. But then I also decided, you know what? I have attended so many trainings taught by doctors and medical professionals in the arena of our emotional health. And there are a lot of protocols that are super simple and there are a lot of natural things that we can do to help harness back and take control of our health again. So why not create this positive content while also teaching you exactly how to take care of your emotional health? So my background is in biology and chemistry. I was a DNA forensic scientist for the state of Ohio for 11 years before I decided to you know, become a stay-at-home mom with our kids. And so I love the science of the oils and learning these natural ways that have a really powerful impact on our health. So this is what this group is going to entail. We are going to set it up in units. So what that means is you need to become familiar with units in the group. So if you're on your phone, you're gonna find units across the top of your screen. If you're on a desktop, you're gonna find it listed on the left-hand side. So every single day, so July 1, there's gonna be a unit posted on July 1, July 2, July 3, right through the course of the week. Each day, there are gonna be three posts, right? One post is going to be something to teach you how to master your emotional health. So what I want to tell you really quickly is that our thoughts and our behaviors dictate the chemistry in our body. So we're going to give you some tools in your toolbox to help take control back over those thoughts and give you some behaviors that are going to help you through this. But the second amazing thing is that using doTERRA essential oils along with these behavior changes helps amplify and anchor those behaviors, creating lasting chemical changes in the body for the better for your emotional health and wealth, right? So we're going to teach you that. So every day, one thing is going to be what you can do for your emotional health. The second post in every day is going to focus on a essential oil and the emotional attributes and the emotional things that it supports in the body. And then the third thing is to, to take what we've learned and to spread the good news, right? So it's going to be about supporting other people and being a positive light in their life. So every single day, you're going to be challenged 
to spread hope to someone else in however way you you see fit. Maybe it's watching your friend's kids to give her a break for a moment. Maybe it's checking in on a neighbor that lives alone. Maybe it's reaching out and sending a message to someone through Facebook. You're gonna get to decide what that looks like. But this group is, is that's what this is ent entailing. It's positivity to get our, our, our positive to negative relationships and interactions back into balance. It is going to be focusing on how you can take control of your mental emotional health using doTERRA as a tool, and it is going to be spreading that to others. So if you wanna stay in this group and participate, which I surely hope you do, here's what you need to do. You need to go to the units section and you're gonna find a registration unit. There are three posts that you're going to read in there, three different things that you're going to do and it's gonna tell you exactly what you need to participate in the group. So I'm so happy that you're here. I can't wait to spend the month of July with you guys.